Well, hello friends, this is Jeff playing Ultimate Admiral, Age of Sail, American Campaign, Backer Bill version, testing it out, and American Campaign, we're continuing on. I recovered from the bug that was in the game, but um, we're going to have the next battle is the Chesapeake. This looks like a grand battle, you can read this if you'd like. Oh boy, look at this. Another large battle. I had a hard time recovering from the last one that I fought. So hard. Okay, well, um, I don't know what the importance of the lineup is here. I don't know. Well, the only thing I have left is my transport ships. Let's see what this monster is. It's taking a while to load. Oh boy, it's got to be a big one. Oh yeah, look at this. Our patrol frigate spotted the enemy fleet a few hours ago. Despite understanding the importance of this fight, we still managed to underestimate their force. Yeah, of course. The battle won't be an easy one. Yeah, it never is, is it? Always. The British have the weather gauge in their favor. We have to wait for now. All that we have achieved over the past five years has culminated to the point. We must prove to the British that we can stand up to their invincible fleet and claim our independence. Is this the end? Oh my God, look at all these ships. So I must have some allies here that will help me out. Okay, oh my goodness. Let's take a look at this. The wind is going this way. We got a 700, 650, 650. I'm gonna cry, 650. 500, 500, 500. Are they attacking? 500, 500, 650, 650. Ay, ay, ay. All right, let's pause this for, oh, and there's even more. <laughs> Another set of, oh, okay. Now, what do I have? Oh, look at all these guys. They're all like... Oh, my God. Look at this. This is a giant naval battle, folks. What am I to do with this? I am in shock and awe. All right. So, we do have a 800 here, but what's their lead ship? Seven. And all right, I gotta try to. This is too big. I mean, I gotta figure out a strategy here. Like, look at this. Oh, all right. All 
right, the wind's going this way. Um, I'm wondering if I could... Is there a way of cutting these off? But we'd be going against the wind. And, there, and if we pr approach this way, they will shoot, no doubt. And it looks like he is going to turn, because they got the wind. And they did say we should wait, so... Uh, the wind's going this way. All right, look, I'm going to... I'm going to see if I can get him to go over here and stop. And that would mean I would want him somewhere over here. And I would want them at full sail until they actually... Um, so, that, so that way they'll be set. And that would mean I would want you somewhere over here maybe. And maybe you could go right there and that would mean you would go maybe right there but you got to be on full sail like yeah i'm just talking it out to myself sorry that i'm kind of like talking out loud i i want to make sure that they're on full sail so that way later on whenever i because they're gonna they're gonna anchor where i put them to anchor i hope so I think if I can set up a line somewhere around in this area here, they're going to have to turn and come into us. And this might buy me time to set up some other strategy too. So Now, of course, this is not going to... If I select him, if I select him... Yeah, I think I told him to go there, but that would mean this ship might just follow him. So I'm wondering if we can engage them, like, right now. Like, if I could... If I could send him... Like, they're going to get the shots on us, I agree, but... I think I want to have two forces. Like, I, I don't, you know, I'm just trying to develop this on the fly. Like, I mean, I'm trying to do something on the fly here because I don't know how this is gonna work but but if I can get my ships to cut some of these off maybe I can like try to wipe some of them out well I mean I don't know if I can I mean I'm just over thinking this but but I think if I if I get them to be moving Maybe we can cut some of these ships off. Like, I don't know how this is going to work out because I know the enemy is going to get first shots on all of these ships as they approach. But I think if I can at least get everybody on full sail and get them heading that way. Yeah, see, these guys are already doing something goofy. So we're going to send that one. Going to send that one. Okay, so this is the end of the line here, so maybe we should send them off that way. Is there a... Where's the 650? Two 650s. Alright, I need the... I need you to go that way, but you can go that way. You can go that way. You need to head that way. And I should have one more. Where is he along the line? I'm supposed to have two fire ships. That's one right here. Where's the other one? Right here. Okay. I just want him to head that way, I guess. Did I sell him? Yeah, and you... All right, well, like I said, this is kind of weird. I know the way I'm doing this, but... I just want to, before I get this going, I want everybody on high sail. I want to make sure they're all on high sail. 
All right, folks, sorry for the delay. Uh, now we'll get it going, and I'll even go a little bit faster just to see how this is going to go. Um, Because, like I said, if I fail at this, I'd have to try this again. But, I mean, I do not know what the best scenario is here. But it's said for us to wait, so I'm thinking that's a, that's a game clue that if I can get these guys... Yeah, maybe... Yeah, let me let me see this from it. Maybe I can have you go right there. And then I'll have you go right there. And I have you go there. Have you go there. And you get over here and back that one up. Alright, that's that group. Okay, so now I have to see how we're going to do this here. Like, who can I cut off? Like, yeah, maybe we can cut this one off. So let's, let's head over there. Let's head on an angle. Yeah, we kind of want to cut them off. Oh, there's even more down here. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I'm, I might be biting off much more than what I can handle, actually. <laughs> yeah, this might not go the way I wanted. I, I, I wanted to get the last four ships, not the last eight ships or whatever. All right, we got to get this back to normal s speed. I'm going to see if he can come up. He, all you guys head this way. And, yeah, you need to switch off that way, I think. Now, the Liverpool, yeah, you can keep going. And where is my other one? All right, so when I have this ship, do you mind uh, anchoring, please? Fix. Can I come over? All right, yeah, we'll forget about those ships. We're gonna come this way. Over there. I'm just trying, like, like you know, hey, I don't know what the heck's going to happen in this battle. This is too big of a battle to be... Yeah, Finch ain't going to do good against these my sh lot smaller ships. But the Liverpool now, on the other hand, if I can take out that one. These guys were just... Their job was to try to cut these ships off. So he's going to turn off that way now. Now you, you're going to come over here. You're going after that one. Okay, you stop over there. Ranger over here, buddy. Yeah, see, we got two of these guys and I don't got anybody to... Oh, I got these guys right here. Okay, yeah, over here. Dennis needs to get up here. Let's go. Okay, now this is gonna... I'm gonna send him off there. I'm sending these guys over here. And this Liverpool... With him going like that... This is gonna be really chancy, but what I'm gonna do... Is I'm gonna see if I can have him go off that way. If I can get him to touch that ship and this ship without um, surrendering, 
Um, I might be able to get two birds with one stone. Now I gotta cut him in like that. Now if he blasts him and he he wavers, then it's gonna screw up. All right now. I think I can do it. Let's see. All right. Now I gotta get these guys away. And this ship might, I might, you know, sacrifice one of the ally ships, but. Oh yeah, and this one's gotta get going. Yeah, the ally ship got to fire too. Not good, but. Like I said, two birds with one stone. Hey, and if the Glasgow gets on fire, I can run it. In. Yep, okay, so Glasgow got on fire, so I'm going to go ahead and have the Glasgow, which is a shame, but I'm going to have it try to grab this ship and get him on fire. Like, I don't think it's going to work, though. That kind of bites. Yeah, I was really hoping. Alright, so, yeah, that, you know, okay, so... They lose two ships, I'm gonna lose two ships. Uh, didn't work right. Hey, maybe he can, yeah, see the pump's going. Whenever the pump goes, the ship's done. Okay, so now Victoria, where are you? Victoria. We gotta get all the sailors off before she blows. Yeah, this, like I said, it didn't quite go the way I thought it would. Oh, uh, yeah, I lost that ship. Dang it, I didn't get the people off it. Hey, but he might catch on fire, so... That's good. Okay, now you guys... Alright, so um, what we're gonna do... And I ain't even watching this other battle over here. Hey, what a mess. Alright, I'm gonna have this one come over here and try to get this one. Yeah, I mean, it really, yeah, like, you know, I had my ships too close, but that was the whole point, was to try to get two birds with one stone, but I ended up doing that wrong, so... Yeah, and he survived it. Ah, oh, man. So I did get two of them, but... Oh, this really bites too because he's turned just right and my ship can't turn. It's going against the wind. Alright, maybe I can cut him this way. I, I mean, I don't even know at this point. Yeah, 
Yeah, I, I, I think I bit off a little too much than what I could handle, actually. Like, and I even got these ships, they were going uh, the wrong way. Oh, now you. Oh, I see, we got... Oh, guys. Okay, you get over there. Hey, Dennis. Yeah, let's get over here. Like, I mean, I'm not even watching the other stuff, but... We're gonna take this one out right here because he's just sitting there like a duck. I'm not, you know, like totally paying attention to everything on the field, but I gotta make sure that this happens. Because I can take out that 700 right there. I won't get two birds with one stone, but I will at least get this one. Because it's gonna have a hard time turning. And I'm not watching the other battles over there. I. I will pause for a second just to see. All right, now if you could, even though there's two ships here, which kind of sucks, you need to capture him. And then you guys need to come over this way. You, can you get on? All right, well, you just get over here somewhere, I guess. All right, so now that's that. Now, let me make sure the other guys are doing what they're supposed to be doing. Now, this ship here, going to repair, and you're going to have to go over here because he, he's wavering and he might surrender. So I'm going to have him go like that. I got the AI going to do that ship there. You two need to get... Not onto each other, but get over here to repair that. Boy, there is so much to this battle. And then you guys have got to get into this. So why don't you get over there for now? And you gotta get over here for now. And you gotta get over here for now. Alright. Get over there. Okay. So now I gotta get back to this, sorry. So I'm gonna move this ship to over here to block him from coming and now here's my last fire ship. So I'm gonna use it on this big one here. If I can take him, he was the lead, so if I can take the lead out, that will be good. Matter of fact, I'll even, like, just glance him, maybe, and maybe he can come down and get that one, too. Let me see. Let me see. Now, if I cut him like that... And he's going on that way, so let's see if this works. I mean, it would be so cool if it worked. If he can just run into this one before he blows up. He's like, he's gonna... Okay. Uh, something broke. Something broke. Usually when the pump breaks, then the ship will blow up. So, this is, is working uh, just the way I... That, uh, again, now this is the way two birds with one stone. I You know, they were in just the right way for me to do it. The only problem I have is if they try to run into my ships, so we gotta have to move a little bit out of position. So at least that worked. But the problem with a ship on a fire is they can keep moving, especially if they're going with the wind. So he might come over here and interfere with these guys, and I don't want to lose those. So, I mean, I'm going to say I did a real excellent job with that particular fire ship. 
Oh, and we got this one right here. Hey, you guys, get on that ship right there. Oh my god, I can't believe it. He surrendered, yes. Not even paying attention. Get over here. Okay, now, let's see how this is going. Yeah, once all those guys get on that ship, we'll have that. Now you go over there. Yeah, I mean, I mean, I'm, I'm tickled pink for blowing those two up. That is, matter of fact, he was a 650 and that was a seven. So that is beautiful. Now I don't know if I can get any of these guys on any of the. Okay, you can go on that one. Can't. I just hope. Yeah. Hey, why don't you? You anchor and shoot at this one here. You anchor there and shoot at him to ch help help uh, send him to Davy's locker. All right, and I got these guys still sitting in reserves. All right, now hey, now these these. These guys are silly. I told them all to get on that ship, and they didn't. All right, so now you need to... Uh, this this one here needs to head that way. You may head that way. You get on there. Like, man, when you select them all to go on a ship, you tell them to do it, they should. All right, I'm not watching all this, but let me pause for a second. This is crazy. Now, these guys are not gonna... Yeah, you can get on. Can you get on? All right, good. These ships are... And now we got a 650 coming. So if he can get through this, then I'll use these two to get him. Then we still have... How many here? Like one, two, three, four, five. And this is gonna be a long video. Just gotta make sure I don't have no ships running around anywhere. Okay. Now. Yeah, I got these right here. Okay, you gotta get up here and assist. Because these ships can't handle it. This one can... Attempt to get that one. You're on this one, and you get on that one. You can repair. You can repair. And you, you're gonna head over there. You're gonna repair. Repair. Okay, now you're gonna head over there, and that one's gonna head over there. Once I can get these guys, now he's turning this way, so maybe I'll send you that way, and maybe I'll send you that way too. Yeah, it's a shame these two weren't into the mix there somehow. And we even got this big boy right here. Come on, let's get over here, boys. Or, no, wait, why don't you come over this way to help there? Yeah, let me, let me stick him to, um, get him also and put him on AI. So that way, those two are on AI and their job is to get that ship. Yeah, and maybe I could put these two... No, I won't put them on AI. I'll, I'm gonna send... They gotta get over here, because there's two right there. These guys have gotta get over there. Because the little ships can't handle it. Alright, so that all is gonna happen. So now I gotta figure this out. Alright, so let's say... They're gonna come this way, so I think if I take... 
this one there, and this one goes there. And if I bring you to right about there, hopefully these will go away by that time. And then you two, I'm going to send this way. Oh, I'll first put anchors, because if they go too far... Yeah, we'll go that way, and then we'll cut it. And did I tell this one? Yeah, I told him to go over there. These bolts, can they? Nope. Alright, I know. I can send them to these ships. Otherwise, they might go off the map. And I don't want to, I don't want to lose them. Because, yeah, see like these guys? Or this one? He's trying to go off the map. All right. Uh, all right, so at least if you tell them to go somewhere, they should. All right. Let's get back to what's going on here. All right. I mean, I would think it'd be it'd be awesome if he tries to come into here. Like, I'm wondering if I should just keep these ships here and see if this one would try to thread through here and get on fire. But sooner or later, these are going to go away. But we do have these guys come in, and, and we gotta we gotta take we gotta take out all these ships anyway. So, but notice how um, so this one lost like 650, and this one's losing 700. So I mean that's just dead sailors. And that was two birds with one stone. Yeah, so this one was sunk. Yep, so they lost 650 and 700. And now this one, I can have him start shooting. Okay, you can come over this way now. You know what I'm going to do now? Now that that's not fire anymore, I'm going to have him go. Because he's got 800 on his ship, so we're going to try to take that one. Okay, we're boarding. 
Now, I would think 800 would take 600, but we will see. And I still have these two coming in, too, so... And I got this one trying to get them. Hey, and now, do I have any sailors anywhere? Yeah. ships have a hard time turning around. Alright, we got it. All right, well, this guy's wounded. I'm going to dump him in there. And I'm going to send him off that way. I gotta see what's going on here. <laughs> These guys are still, still uh, weird. Okay. Who is this? Hey, and where, where, where are you going? Get over here. You? Where's the near? Oh, right here. Get over here, you guys. Alright, and... This guy's right there. Maybe I can have you get on this one. Hey, you. Man, trying to get these guys to land on ships is like crazy. Well, six might be able to do it. It looks like they're boarding, so maybe we'll get lucky and an AI will take over one of those ships. That would be awesome. But this is, you know, this is going to be a long video. Okay, now I'm wondering if I should initiate... Yeah, maybe I'll... I mean, this is this would be an even fight. So if I can initiate boarding and come down on this one, I got this one coming in the wings. Uh, wind's going that way. You go that way. I got this one coming, and I have this one coming. All right. So, and then I can. Anchor this one and drop some guys off here to get on this one to try to overpower him. So I think that's what I'm going to have to pay attention to. I'm just going to have to hope that all this stuff... Because he is supposed to try to take him, but he's in the way, so maybe I'll have him stop over there. You can see I have the AI on, so I'm going to see if he can get him. That was his job. This one I didn't, but I'm gonna have him go over here because he's kind of he's blocking him from turning. Which all right, why don't you just go over there? Maybe. I don't know. And again, yeah, let me 
Let me tell him to do that and put him on AI too. Because. Like, I think I should get that, so maybe I will have him. Yeah. He's staying on AI, and he'll go after that one. I think I should have this, and if I don't, both of these ships will be weaker. Even if he takes mine, takes that one. I don't have anybody else anywhere, do I? Alright, folks, like I said, I'm sorry that I'm all over the place, but this is the largest battle that I've ever been in. You know, and it's it's all, you know, look at look at this. So I'm just trying different strategies and different things. But, okay, so let's do it. Yeah, I can anchor the big boy right here. Because if he initiates boarding... Let me just pause for a second. Where is Villa? You see Villa anywhere? Oh, right here. Alright, let me drop out a few sailors. I gotta get these sailors on. I think I'll drop out two more. See how I have to keep doing it because if they start to waver. Alright, so we got this one. So I'm just going to drop one unit in it. 47. That way we have it. Okay, now wait. The ranger is on fire. Hopefully, you can try to put it out. Oh, and this one won. Now, oh, what? What? Uh, wait, wait. What the heck? I don't know what happened here. How come I couldn't send any units to this ship? Maybe because it was on AI? I... Okay, wait a minute. Be robust. So many ships, I can't find... Oh. Yeah, why can't I... Okay. Alright, your job is to take this ship. I don't know why I wasn't able to do that. What the heck? Something's screwing up. Man, there is too much to have to pay attention to here. Oh yeah, and this one... Holy 
Holy cow. And you two guys, like, what are you all doing? Man, I'm uh, gonna repair and anchor. This one is gonna anchor so anybody can try to get on a ship, I guess. Look, you, you move off that way so these guys can get this ship, please. And your job is to get this ship, okay. Man, holy smokes. All right, as a matter of fact, any little ship that has a couple of guys Wow, where is the red... Where is holy? Wow! Way over here. Look, did you see how big this map is? Or this ocean, should I say? Look at that! Oh my gosh! All right, so he's gonna go that way. Yeah, I just... Look, you gotta get over there. You... Why are you showing me this? See how it won't... You, you know, it won't disengage like... You know... Oh well, wait, maybe it's gotta have a pause. Okay, go. Alright, yeah, that's probably why. Okay, so... I want you to move... You gotta come like that, maybe. You gotta go off that way. You gotta go 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 that way. way. Alright, man, this is so much. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna take AI off. I'm gonna have you plant yourself right there. I'm gonna take AI off. I want you to plant yourself right there. We have other shooting going on? Where? I just cannot keep up with this. There's too much going on. Yeah, see the wind has changed. You need to go that way. Yes, he's going to try to get this ship because it only has 69 guys on it. 
Okay, man, this is too much. Well, you can at least try to get him then, right? You come up here and get this one. This is getting a bit intense. Unbelievable battle. This is a giant battle. And see, the problem with a battle like this... Problem like the battle like this. Is, okay, now get over there. There's so much going on. It's a giant battle. But if I can just get these ships to do. catch the wind and then I'm going to try to turn him in, but... Oh, we got this one, though. Oh, and we got this one. See, by making that ship go that way, it forced them to go a certain, the other ships to go a certain way. And I was able to cut some of these off and stuff, so that is good. Okay, so now this one needs to get over here. You need to get over there. And then you need to follow him. Match the speed. All right, I'm just going to pause for a second. Um... Try to catch to see what is going on on this battle. Boy, this is a big one now. Okay, so we have an enemy ship here. So you, you should be shooting at it. Okay, that's that. Now you need to get over here. You're 151. I'm just gonna have you go off that way. You'll be no good to me. And then this ship here, he can repair himself. And maybe he can get over there a little bit. And this one, can you repair yourself? Yep. You can get over there in the America. Get over here, maybe he can block him or something. Alright. Oh yeah, this is one of my ships. Okay, you can get over here. And you actually gotta turn, because you're supposed to try to grab this one. And matter of fact, you cut in this way so you can read them too. those two to deal with. How am I going to do that? Oh, man, you got this guy right here. Yeah, see how everything got all crazy, like, all over the place? And a good ship that has 643, I need this in the action here. Alright, why don't I turn this one to go that way? You gotta go down. Alright. 
All right, because if I could get one of these, then I'm down to these two ships. I just gotta be careful they don't try to get one of the smaller ships. So I have two small ships here. Matter of fact, send you that way. Now you get over here. So much to try to... Yeah, either one of these could fail. Now see, what I'm wondering is, is he... What, what is his intent? I need this one to get over there. You can try to block him off, I guess. But you... You... Where... Oh, that's an enemy ship. What am I doing? <laughs> Trying to, I'm trying to grab him. Ay, ay, ay. I'm losing my mind in this gigantic battle. It, this is barely going to happen, so maybe I should just... Well, I told him to park anyway. Yeah, this one... Oh. No. What the heck? Alright, look. You go that way. You're supposed to anchor Providence. Drop out somebody. Okay. Would you... Oh, this one... Pro oh, Province over here. Well, what's that one called? Province 2? Alright, we see if you can get this ship over here. Alright, I'm going to send him that way then. Because, you know, he's got 400. He can take that one. Man, we still haven't... Hey, he's, he, he lost his water pump. I'm going to get rid of all the junk ships that I have that are worth nothing because they don't have anybody on them. So they can get out of the way the ships that I need.
Yeah, see, all my ships are gonna be... Yeah, so I got three ships shooting at this one, and it looks like he's sinking. So that'll rid me of this problem. Boy, what a big battle this is. Two hundreds, so get over here. You got seven hundred, you need to get moving. Okay, so we can cut this one off. Let's do it. Matter of fact, I'll send you over here to help him. Yeah, he's intent on trying to get one of his ships back. Like, it's nice if you can do just one-on-one -on -one battles, but with all these these things going on in this battle, it was complicated to to get this done. What a giant battle! And I don't really want to board this guy. I just want to be. I just want to delay him from going forward, so this one can catch up. Because he's content on trying to get that ship, so I'm not gonna worry about that at the moment. That's not my priority. My priority is to wipe out anybody that I can possibly wipe out. And this is an ally ship. This is not mine, because I don't have any perks here, so I, that's why I know it's not. Okay, so now if I anchor him there... If I can get him to anchor right there, like I told you to anchor, dude, you should anchor. All right, you know what? I'm going to have that one initiate boarding, and then I will tell this one to initiate boarding, repair, and anchor. And that should take care of that ship. And if not, he'll at least be weaker if they those two ships fail their mission. What else do we have? Alright, uh, you guys are no good to me. Get over here. Alright, you go off that way. Yeah, you gotta go that way too. I guess we need to send everybody. Because this is a, a fight to the death. Alright, now where was that ship that was over here somewhere? There he is. He's still floating. Alright, let's turn. I mean, he's, he's supposed to be sinking. Yeah, and see, I don't have this ship, uh, ain't, you know, this ship is supposed to be... Oh, good. 
Uh, that'll rid me of that problem. Yeah, he almost lost, and I was going to try to get... But because there's two province ships, I don't even know how I would get troops off this ship to get, on, to get over here to help him. But... It worked out, so... Now you need to go that way. And you two can just head off into the wild blue yonder, I guess. Alright, so now what do we have? Where's the... Okay. <laughs> oh boy, cannon set. The cannon set. So... The, the allies have got... Well, 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 it's one way of wiping him out, I guess. Like, I, I wasn't paying attention, and this ship caught on fire. Hey, maybe if I send him up this way, maybe... He no, he can't. He's too much engulfed. All right, well, I can anchor him. And I can take sh take the guys off because they're just going to die anyway. So we will just empty the ship. And send them to whoever can take them right there. Yeah, because see, once the rudder goes, then the pump will go, and then the ship will blow up, so... Gotta get these guys onto a ship. I don't care what ship, just get on there. Okay, and so, and... Alright, so, you know, like I said, I complain about these ships when they shoot canister or whatever, that they get on fire. Like, I've seen two... In the last two battles, I've seen too many of that happening, so I think it happens way too often in the game, and I think... I think they should tone that down a little bit. But, as you see, if you have a ship like this that's in this situation, get all the troops off it, because you're going to lose it anyway, and there's no sense in losing hundreds of them. Because it's a, it's a lost cause. Once they once they get, like, one-third of the ship on fire, it's, it is a total lost cause. So we're going to... We're just gonna anchor everybody for now. Oh, now we got another ship on fire? Oh, that's that one. Okay. Whatever. Okay. Alright, so I don't think any enemy around here. So now what do we have left? Yeah, those ships just going into the wild blue yonder because they, they have nothing on them. Where is the last enemy ship? Oh, right here. All right, he's going to. He's going to. Hey, why don't you come over this way to help out? As a matter of fact, you peel off so this 700 can get over here and take out this one. Can you at least peel off a little bit? I mean, do fire at him. Come on, peel off. Yeah, I don't think it's going to happen. Can I anchor you for just a moment to see if this one can peel off? Uh-oh. Oh, that's just the fire ships. Yeah, I don't care about that. All right. All right, now you, my friend, get your sails back on. It was just to get him to peel off because I need this guy to get in between these two ships so we can go ahead and get rid of this ship. What a, this was a long battle, folks. Tell me, tell me in the comments what you think about this particular battle. I mean, these last two battles are are vicious. 
fight and all. I mean, I'm sure anyone who loves sea battles, they're gonna love this. Because you just got all of the biggest and best ships in the game right here. Alright, now cut into him. And canister. Now pull him in. And you get close. And you go right here. Just in case he tries to squiggle out of here. Alright, now let's see how this goes, folks. 688 against 459. And this ain't one of my ships. This is the uh, the ally ship. And I think I put extra sailors on it. From the other ships that sunk or got burnt or whatever. I mean, I would think we should be able to win this outright. But I have these two ships coming in just in case because you never know, sometimes ridiculous things happen in this game and you lose a ship. It just gives up having 300 on it or something. Just depends who's wavering. Like he's wavering slightly. Yep, excellent. I'll just dump somebody there to claim the ship. Who's left? Oh, nobody! Excellent! Oh my goodness, what a tough, long battle, folks. That was gigantic of a battle. It took all my ships. Like, I only had three transports left in my whole navy. So this took all, like, I don't even know how many ships it was. Yeah, it was ten ships. Like, I put 10 ships into this battle, but we had 18 because there were some allies. And they had 15. I mean, it was kind of fair, I guess, I, I would have to say. And it says zero here, but it doesn't account for my two explosive barrel ships that I put into this battle. And I captured 10 of their ships, so 10 out of 15 ships. Not bad, I mean... And, and that's the way to do it, otherwise this battle would last another couple of hours. I mean, if you just try to bang it out with them, I mean, that, you know. And it's so many, and this thing, is, this ocean is so large that I'm going to tell you that you're going to end up with a ton of ships all over the place, all these battles, and it's very hard to maneuver without pausing every 10 seconds. And, and that wouldn't be fun for you to watch, so. So I try to grab them as quick as possible. You know, you'll take tremendous losses doing that. But anyways, if you want to look at this one more time, go ahead. The goal is eliminate. So this was a fight to the death. I mean, you know, it's for our independence. Now, this is a list of all the ships. You can see the Liverpool. That was uh, mine. That was a fire strip. My fire ship. And the Dennis was. So those are my two fire ships. They had 247. That's why I was getting rid of those ships. Because they, they can't. That's all. That, that's the max that I could put on those ships. And so that's this is a way of me recycling them out of the battle, and they and they did their job. I mean, they took out some really big ships in this in this this thing. So, anyways, now oh now my Glasgow was destroyed, yeah, because it was it caught it got caught up in that fire, I think. So yeah, I lost the Glasgow. I've had that for quite a while in this game. Whenever whatever battle it was that you get the Glasgow. I had it all the way up to this last battle, so but I lost it. All right, anybody else? And Bedford, the HMS Bedford, that must be a city in uh, England, but when uh, the pilgrims came over, they landed in, you know, wherever they landed. I forget. Oh, I don't, I don't, I'm not a great history buff, but I know the pilgrims came, and, and they made a city in New Bedford, Massachusetts, and that's where I'm from. And there is a whaling city there because we used to be a whale, you know, a couple hundred years ago, we used to be a whaling city. We used to go after, you know, that's where Moby Dick came from and stuff. But, so yeah, I'm from there and, you know, so my, my, my hometown is New Bedford, Mass. So we called it New Bedford, but in England it's probably called Bedford. So it's just an interesting thing that, you know, because we, we came over from England. So I just wanted to give you that little bit of history of me and, and stuff, but anyways. But 
I'll, I'll scroll through this if you want to look at all this. I mean, this was a long and arduous battle, so, um, and I am so happy that I won it. So now we're going to go to officers. And we got wounded, wounded. Hey, this guy got to a Commodore. This guy got to a Rear Admiral. So you go from Commodore to Rear Admiral. And you go from Captain to Commodore. Now we lost a Captain Midshipman. Oh, we lost a Commodore. And we lost a Rear Admiral. Oh, that hurts. And he got to a Lieutenant. Uh, and the goods. <laughs> oh, look at this, folks. Captured a 78, a 78 gun ship. And then all of these are 68 gunships. I mean, the, this was an incredible battle. I am so happy to have it, ha to, to have won it. So happy. Really, yeah, that was something else. And, and whatever strategy I used, I guess it worked. But like I said, you know, I know the game said to hold off because the British had the wind or something. So, anyways, I'm so happy to have gotten out of this. And what I'm gonna do... If I ever get to the harbor... <laughs> I am definitely going to save. Definitely going to save, because look how long this is taking to load. I hope it doesn't crash. Please don't crash. I want this. Come on. You're going to hear my plead. I mean, don't forget, this is early access, so if it does happen, I can blame it on early access. Oh, my God. Oh, whew, thank God we're here. I've got to save. And what was that called? Oh, uh, I think it was called Chesapeake. -A 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 yeah, I'll know when I do this. Yeah, yeah, okay, the Chesapeake, but. Well, let's take a look at it. Look at this. The Chesapeake. From Thursday, February 17th, 1780. Cornwallis has surrendered and the Royal Navy presence in the colonies has been extinguished. Peace delegates are already beginning to arrive in Paris and it won't be long before our independence is achieved. Over, last, over these last years, you have shaped our Navy into something even the mighty British fear. You will surely go down in history as the father of our Navy. Congratulations and Thank you for all that you have done for us, Admiral. 76,216 and three. Look at that. Three points. And I already saved, right, folks? Yeah. So I have three points. I could go one there to max that out, and I would have upgrade cost, minus 25% upgrades. I have luck, 30% chance luck for those points of interest. And I have 25% survival of officers to not die in a battle. I have reputation, five reputation per battle. I have 25% on sale and minus 25% on purchases. And here I'm up 25% on mission thing. Oh, and this one here I had um, technology costs down 25%. So I was able to max all those out and I still have two points.
I do spend a lot in repair. Uh, yeah, why don't I just drop it in repair for the heck of it? And we'll do just that. We'll repair. So, 51. 296. 275. Six fifty five eighty seven one fifty nine three th yeah this one the ranger got really hurt thirty four hundred wow and that's even with um whatever percentage I got uh yeah so I spent thirty four hundred on that and um And that was minus 15% on rip repair costs, and that still cost $3,400. <laughs> wow. Hey, I got some reserves. I wonder if those sh those those guys that were on the little lifeboats, if they don't make it to a ship, do they get dropped into here? And look at and look at the stats of them. Intelligence 95, Dexterity 99, Strength 49, Perception 99, Willpower 70, and Endurance 94. So I got 389 guys that I can put on something and do that. And I don't understand if if this was after the accumulation of five years, how come I only have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven medals? There's one here and two more that I didn't get. I must I wonder if you have to do certain um like when you answer those questions do you get um do you get like a different battle or something and maybe you'll get a medal i don't know all right but we got all this let me just go to my ships and and you know put officers on them so that way Gotta make sure all my ships have all. Look at this one. On this ship, I had all people who bought this Admiral Edition game. Ain't that something? That whole ship is a representative of all the people who bought the Admiral Edition. And I got trophy, 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 trophy. Trophy, trophy, jeez. Hey, yeah, that's Chip Survive, the Finch. They, and, and here's John Paul. And these are my um, transport ships that weren't in the battle, so look at that. All these guys. I have two nice artillery units. Check it out. They're only four pounders, though. All right, folks. Well, this was a long and tough battle. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go here, menu, and I'm going to save. I'm going to say after harbor. And then I'm going to come back. Well, I'm going to upload, and then I will... Uh, come back and then we'll uh we'll end the chapter together like maybe i'll i'll do some of my ships and get them up and running like like i've done it all my battles and there's not one person that watches this that have said that they enjoyed watching me do this so so yeah so i saved it and i'm going to end it here i hope you all are doing good in the world I know China has lost a lot of people from that virus, so, you know, just uh, take care of yourselves, you know, keep your uh, social, you know, people that you talk to a lot and stuff, be careful, you know, wash your hands, um, you know, have a good day or a good evening, no matter where you are in the world, take care of yourself, God bless you, this is Jeff signing out. 
Adios, amigos. We will be back later, folks, to see what's next. Have a great one. Jeff signing out.